My friends, welcome back to EU4. We're playing as Cologne. I know the speed is just on free and you are expecting something like four to five and I cannot do that for you. We're sieging down Arch in here, which is going to be glorious. We're actually gaining some uh, some money of that. Well, actually we were gaining money for that. We already got one of the aggressors out and it won't be long until Nessa falls. If we're going to do this before uh, the Papal Nates fall, I don't think so, but our ally is starting to head over. He is confident that he can do this. I'm hoping he's right. If he can, that would be amazing. If not, then it could be disastrous. So, right now... Oh, come on, dude. You have less morale, which is not good. But by the looks of it, we're winning. Yeah, they won. That's good. That is so good. We have nothing to worry, worry about. Let's go and meet them in the battlefields. Uh, making sure we get out of this war would be the best. Uh, I think it won't be long until they peace out Archon. And, and their armies are gone. It is over. Who else are we fighting? Mainz, Archon, Nassau. All is going to be dropping. Let's go back to our capital. Actually, not quite sure if we go to the capital. We have a problem here with Berg. I cancelled military alliance with them. So that's semi-annoying and I do want my troops over here. Nassau we can't deal with. I don't think he can. No, we can't. So once this falls, it, it it's the war is over. We, we did our best, we've honoured our call and I'm extremely happy about it. Um, yeah, honoured our, our alliance plus nine... It's sweet. It is sweet. Countries at war. Yeah, you can't handle this, man. They're black flag. They can't do anything. They won't lose troops, but... Oh, well. Let us drop down army maintenance. There we go. And we can actually... Mothball the forts. Making even more money. 8.3. What we need to do is just go over here. Look, they're out. The war is... Done. Those troops disappeared. They're gone forever. <laughs> it's not how it works, though. But um, they pissed out with... Uh, with whom? A full annexation was the demand. Mains. No, seriously, you should have pissed out the others first. Oh, well. Well, it's good for them. I'm hoping they... Uh, if they are going to be declared upon by Austria... There's no way, buddy. I, I will drop that alliance like a brick. Oh yeah, of course, Nassau was the one. You took Mainz? He was... Was he the reason? No, here we go. Informed that Salzburg elected... They are now a elector in the Holy Roman Empire, really. Yeah, because Mainz dropped. Mainz is no longer part of the HRE. Um, man, this is going to be a tight one. Austria, 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 uh, Saxony, Saxony, Saxony. Yeah, the, the empire is split apart. Okay, for you, manage those bloody rebels. There we go. There's the next one. Uh, we've they own us 14 favors, which is very nice. We have too few of uh, too few our uh, rivals. Okay, who are we going to be selecting? Hey, Munster is back as a rival, guys. Yeah. Let's, let's do it. Let's take it. Can we actually go to war with you? I could actually... Mm, how long? We don't have a free diplomat. You are all allied again with Oldsbrook. Um, yeah, you, you can't do anything, mate. We're going to take down those troops and then smash down. I don't even think that I'm going to be uh, needing the aid of uh, anyone else. Let's do this right away. I want to humiliate a rival. Let's wait until the morale ticks up and we'll go to war with Munster. Smash down Oldenbrook first and then deal with those troops from Munster. Yeah, we've gained humiliated rival causes barely against, uh, against Munster. And I think Oldenbrook will honor the call. Now, Hesse wasn't an ally of mine, but he did not call us in. I don't think he will be allowed to take all of Hesse. 
I kind of hope he won't, since he's four and we're four on four. I kind of want my alliance. Let's take a look here, technology-wise. Yeah, we're we're on tech, tech six. We're way way ahead, and I'm happy about it. That means we're going to be developing quite a bit here. Um, improving relations with Munster. Yeah, I don't know about that, buddy. Let's call you back, since we are going to do a war with you. Can we, can we please get our advisor? Thank you. Let's wait one more tick, then humiliate. We're not going to be calling in our allies. We don't need that, but humiliation we do need. So we're going to wait one more tick, and then it's off to war, humiliate our rival. Hopefully the rebels eventually will stop being dicks. Stop it. But these guys need to go first. So here we go, we're full. We are going to confirm this. And go in right in there for this uh, attack. If they reinforce, they will still lose a good amount of troops. They didn't even bother about it. Which is great. Let us wait until we get the rest of that. That is out. Let's consolidate. Let's leave an infantry behind so they can make trips. And we still have our general over here. Let's smash them. Smash them. This war is done. It's already over. And we will smash those troops and just siege down everyone else. What an easy war. I can't believe he actually is my rival. Even with all of those river crossings. Let's go there. I'll leave one troop and then siege out Oldenbrook first. Okay, that's done. Consolidate yet again. And I think we're now 8 on 8. So I'm not going to be bothering bothered about it. Uh, shall we leave a calf? Since, well, they, we don't really need him. Let's go here. And siege those down. This war is done. This war's done. I like it. So let's group those guys up. We can leave a detachment for the siege, but I don't want to. On a, you can call allies to war. We don't need it. Claims that will expire on East Frisia. Oh, wow. That's actually almost all of our claims that are going to be expiring. We should start building up claims again. Uh, let's see over here. Yeah, we're going to wait. We're going to wait with that. There's no point in doing that right now. I want to develop. Seriously, um, this ticking up is so annoying. Uh, morale of armies going down, which is actually not a big deal. What we could do... Yes, we're still making money. Uh, but we don't need our full military support anymore. We can actually just do like half of it. We're making 1.4. And let's unmaintain our fort. Making even more. And I think it's going to be time that we actually take another advisor. What do we have? Trade efficiency. Diplomatic relations. I kind of like to get you. 1.15 is a lot. But I'll take you anyways. So, 085, we have finally got our second advisor. So, one more to go. Uh, Thierry has um, embraced the Renaissance. Damn you. It's all due to this. That's so annoying. <laughs> I want to embrace this so badly. Damn you. Ah, embrace already. Oh, well. What can you do about it? Not, not much. Yes, I could have developed. Yes, I could have developed, and I didn't. Sorry, forgive me. Didn't mean to. But it's what it is. Um, let's go with allies. We do have to improve. Like 12 points. It's, it's not a lot. Uh, but we'll have to make sure that this keeps going. Uh, the Ottomans. And I think this is France, yes. Who will you go to next? I'm hopefully Austria. You're actually improving with the mum, the mem looks like, dude. It's seriously, that's all the way over here. And those are those guys are big. They are big. They're monstrous. Yeah, they're just they're just eating away. I'm hope 
Ooh, the Ottomans is having problems here with the Caramans. What the hell happened? You are winning these wars, which is not odd. Uh, Austria, no longer at war. He is not angry. He is neutral. Oh, thank God. Oh, man. Okay, so you know we are going to be without a war for a long time in which we can actually take territory, right? Let me just make that absolutely clear. It is not going to happen anytime soon. We just have to deal with all of this. So we're raiding. And we are also raiding over here. It's going to be uh, close because we are actually getting a lot of our cash from war reps. Let's see over here, like spoils of war. We would make a negative. Mm, yeah, which is not good. Um, as the new emperor, new laws for... Uh, wait a minute. Yes, they have embraced an imperial reform. Actually, that's good. That is good. I quite like this. Um, gain another diplomat. National unrest for us. I would back that up as well. Eventually, we'll have to stop. Because that's going to be annoying. So, the year 70. There has to be a tooltip. When? Mm, and we're actually down to 50 princes. Some of them already fell. Um, I think with from this on, we will not take it. Since um, absolutism, I don't like that. Because he will no longer have to be elected. Yearly prestige, technology cost negative. So we, don't, we'll, we won't back this up too much. Uh, looking at this, um, there are only 11 princes that are in uh, before this reform. Um, but I'm glad about this one. We'll actually, um, that will save us money in terms of development. And in terms of technology, uh, not so much yet. Workshops, farm estates. Yeah, okay, well, we'll just hold, but we do need to develop this. And get those rebels out of here. 8 on 8, that's just bad. Uh, just getting rid of those uh, rebels is going to be annoying. It is dying out. So it is dying out. For the longest time, it will die out. I'm so happy we were gaining 6, 7, 6 and 12 in military. With 12 in military, we are going to be developing military. Making sure we are a... A military present that people will have to deal with. Hopefully uh, Munchen will not drop as a rival before this war ends. I don't think it will work like that. No, I don't think so. Yeah, what, what is, why is this going down? Unlawful territory. And we voted for them is slowly going down. These guys don't have the renaissance either, so military attack on them is going to be uh, horrible as well. There you go. Go there. And we need to get our... Diplo okay, we don't care about the Memlux as much as the AI apparently does. It's going to take us a month. And we're going to be piecing these guys out. Just for war reps, like always. Maybe steering trade. Just all of your money. I'm okay with that as well. Just all of your money. Let's group you up. Diplomat is free. Sue for peace. Uh, war reps. Anything else? Enforced fleet? No. Military presence? I don't care. Treaties with Munster? No. Seriously. No. Actually, don't care. Just 15. Okay. Uh, steer your trade as well then. Here you go. Here you go, Brandenburg. Thank you for participating. Oldenburg gained a, uh, a negative in prestige. We're actually above 50 now. So we're even gaining more. Oh, sweet. Man, this game is so much different than the previous attempt, right? If you were there. It was glorious. No. <laughs> it ended in defeat. Um, we are going to be giving this to the burgers. And we're going to give more territory to the church. 
Actually, we don't need to. At least I don't think so. But I'm happy that we probably can just deal with this. Can we now embrace the Renaissance? That is a question. Ah, uh, no. It's just going to take time to, to just get in all of my colonies. This one's almost there. We're, we're growing by one per month. It's actually three years. How about you? Uh, that's a lot longer. And I don't want to develop all of this. I want to develop the grassland because it's cheaper. So I've been told. Yes. Uh, for now. Let's go with neighboring countries. Countries at war, Mothbot Fort, local unrest. We'll have to deal with that. Uh, we can just leave a small stack behind. Yeah, they have nothing. And yeah, we're going to be uh, humiliating the life out of you. We're actually, we should not take too long getting the justified wars. Now, getting higher development in colonies is not useful at the moment. Combat terrain. Everything in the HRE is like woods. So, yeah, that, that's <laughs> not helping out that much. Uh, Cleves is just training troops like crazy. Who are you allied with? Yeah, this is slowly dying out. Uh, England, Burgundy. England, not at war. Burgundy, not at war. Lorraine. Who the hell is Lorraine? This guy. I don't care about Lorraine. But England and Burgundy? Ah, that's something else. France should go to war against England. Burgundy will help. That would be the perfect opportunity for me to go against Cleves. And I'm actually considering vassalizing them. Just vassalizing Cleves. Not taking the terrain. Because we will get... Uh, about negative 40 in unlawful territory when we take cleaves. However, with our diplomatic idea group, uh, we found the siege in Munster, which is good. Let's go over there so we can suppress the rebels again. And uh, Oldenbrook, yeah, we'll deal with you again later. Not right now. Uh, peace offer from Munster. L let me decide on the peace offer, mate. Uh, I, I can perfectly do this myself. And we are here to humiliate you. Humiliate war reps. All of your money. I don't care for your alliance. I don't want your military access. Well, you know what? That's for the fun of it. Let's do that. There we go. We humiliated a rival. This one is now fulfilled. We'll even gain more points. Um, probably at the first this will change. I hope. There we go. We're now gaining plus three. Which is nice. Very nice. And I do want to get this development done. For now, suppress those ugly ass rebels. And let's die all of this down. That was done, so we'll actually, we're making one. We are able to get another building going. And I think that would be very well to get that going into trade. Actually get Curl in that building as well. And these buildings are getting close, but not there yet. Once development is done, having that in here would be brilliant. Uh, but we're not there yet. So until the uh, the rebel factions die out. And we're actually getting sailors now. The unrest is almost gone. In Groningen. Okay. Let's see. What's this? A Thiers or Prestige? I'll go. I'll take the Prestige hit. Because Thiers has also taken Nassau. Thiers is getting big guys. Um, I'm actually surprised that Austria... Has not demanded them to return this. I am surprised. So this, these, these, these larger guys are starting to become my allies. So. Cleaves. Yeah, we have to deal with Cleaves. But we'll, we'll have to make sure this, uh, this stops. Why the negative uh, 13? Oh, there we go. Man, I love this song. 
It makes no sense, but I love this song. Now, Force Limit is still 8. I've joined the Trade League. No, we don't care that you joined the Trade League, dude. We don't care. For now, let's just have our Diplomat do the neighbor thing again. Let's make sure our neighbors are peaceful. Um, we do want to start fabricating on Utrecht, Gelre, Cleves. We don't have to go and take Munster, although, yeah, it's not big. We can eventually take it but not right now a knowledge sharing from Tier. what does this do for us uh, Tier is giving us the chance to catch up with our technology presence in the means of knowledge sharing giving us one percent growth towards renaissance in our capital uh no no sorry um no i, I don't need this um will this take them a negative I don't think so. No, it didn't. Uh, the reason I don't want this is it's just two more years. There is no need to do this. Soon it will be uh, present. And we can actually embrace this. Current technology cost plus 20, which is... That's horrible. That is horrible. Look at this. It will cost us 700. Military points for uh, inflation. I'll take the inflation. Um, will this die out? No. Eventually, we could pay it off. But we don't need to. It's not that expensive at the moment. I'm just waiting for the renaissance here to tick. Uh, rebel faction to die out. 5.1 not a okay this this was 0 0.9 autonomy is starting to decline it's taking us a long as time to kill this mm, i wish there was something for it this is now we could actually start development uh once again don't want to reasons are if we go to technology embrace development cost negative five all the negatives will help us spending less points and we actually are getting look at this holy shit we would need 1200 because we're so far ahead um brunswick also has the renaissance so we'll start more growth in these regions i guess no no no, no. that's not what i want go away uh back Next month, you'll see that this will change. Because it, we are having a neighbor here. This should change, right? Oh, it's in here. Well, okay. For then, then don't don't change. Ooh, yearly corruption or two inflation. I can deal with the yearly corruption. Till 82, that's 10 years. Yearly corruption of 0. Point. Yeah, that's going to cost me a tiny bit. Um, 11. Yeah, it's a whopping 0. 0.11. I'm happy that I took that. Influence dying out from the church. Uh, we can actually take technology again. The workshops, 5%. Don't want to take this due to the renaissance. I want the renaissance before we take this. This, this is bull. This is just bull. Anyways, guys, that's it for this episode. And I'll see you next one. Uh, in Oh, wow. That's it for this episode. And I'll see you next time. That's what I wanted to say. Didn't came out that way. Hope you enjoyed. Goodbye.